What's up guys, it's your boy Loon here. Welcome to another video and finally we have another full day of eating. I know it's been a long time since my last full day of eating video. I'm really excited to get back on this train. So today is going to be a little unorthodox from my usual full day of eating. Instead of it being OMAD and planned out, this is kind of a freestyle. It will still be intermittent fasting. I'm going to be fasting to probably around 8 p.m., maybe 8.30. Throughout while I'm eating certain things, you guys will be seeing the calorie count and the macro count for everything. It is going to be more relaxed. I'm just going to kind of be eating whatever things that I see and feel like eating. It's kind of just a realistic full day of eating instead of me planning things out like I used to. Well, I hope you guys enjoy the video. I am going to go to work right now. I probably will take you guys along with me for a little bit of work. Michelle is coming in as a client today. I will be taking you guys through a little bit of the workout that I am doing with Michelle. Maybe you guys can kind of get a feel on what I do for a living, which is personal training. All right, so sit back to relax and enjoy the vlog. out there who watch my old full day of eating videos you guys know what we got to start the day with a whole lot of water all right let's head to work vagina boob vagina boob this song is dedicated to a certain kind of people white people i get bullied in school i can't wait till i'm a cop so i can bully you white people so we are officially in the office as you guys can see this is the personal training office in o2 fitness first thing i usually do when i first get in here i always get about 10 15 minutes in early kind of get everything organized in terms of clients that i have for the day today i have five different clients not including michelle i will not be taking you guys on each and everything but i will We'll be recording Michelle's workout somewhat and kind of show you guys what I do for a living. Look who it is. It's the famous, what are you, Instagram boxer, boxer lady, Michelle Mai herself. All right, so I always start off workouts with stretching, then the compound movements, unless it's a client who's looking for balance training or something like that. But she's looking for a big booty. So we're going to start off with a calf stretch. Damn, dog, look how big those little lemmings are. All right, so we're starting with safety bar squats. The reason why I have Michelle doing these right here is because she has scoliosis. This is actually really good for your back because it keeps your back very straight. All right, get ready and do three reps to warm up. Get off your phone. It's workout time. My husband. Who's your husband? Odell Beckham Jr., the third. Duke Marius Triceratus, the fourth. The Tyrannosaurus. Rex. Jack Marius Tactheratrix. If you guys notice, her back's gonna be straight AF. We're going for six. By the way, guys, I'm not showing you guys each and everything of the workout, but I am gonna give you guys snippets of the good stuff. So this is actually Fitness Influencing Training 101. It's a course I teach for eight easy payments of $24.99. You have to pay that within 15 days and then there's another installment. And uh, I guarantee that you will have at least a thousand followers by the end of the program. Uh, <laughs> so I'm having her do jump squats into wall sits, which is brutal. She's single, greasy and single. That sounds like an album cover. Thanks for stopping by, bro. I do this with all my clients. Every single one of my clients know that handshake. <laughs> Real quick, I'm gonna show you guys what it's like to be a YouTuber or a wannabe YouTuber like me. I have a part-time job as a personal trainer and in between my breaks, I'll edit my YouTube video. As you can see, this is actually my last video. If you guys haven't watched this video yet, it's actually a really fun watch. We went to see a Matthew McConaughey movie called The Gentleman. Got invited to the pre-screening, which is a great time. Yeah, the grind is real. All right, guys, we are back at Emily's place right now and she is right there uh, just hanging out watching Vampire Lame Show. Yeah, Vampire Diaries suck compared to Team Wolf. Team Wolf is better. If you're Team Jacob, you're obviously... Oh, wait. You're a cool person if you're Team Jacob. If you're Team Edward, you are a... What is that, Twilight? Yeah, as in vampires are stupid. And... Twilight's stupid. You're stupid. Thank you. Hi, hi. You're hot. We are about to get to the full day of eating. I'm gonna show you guys each and everything we're gonna be eating. And remember, it is gonna be a more relaxed full day of eating. We are still intermittent fasting. It is currently 8.18, as you guys can see. So we are officially breaking the fast. So the first thing we are gonna be eating in today's full day of eating is gonna be turkey burgers. We are gonna pair the turkey burgers with some French fries, store-bought French fries, just gonna oven them. And then also some broccoli on the side as well. And I'll show you guys all that. So we are running low on broccoli. So I'm gonna throw in some cauliflower as well. And this is just gonna be frozen broccoli 
onion cauliflower, which I'm just gonna microwave. And if you guys haven't tapped into the frozen veggies, I don't know what you guys are doing. You guys are probably idiots because frozen veggies, no, I'm just joking, but frozen veggies is the way to go. It's the fastest, efficient way. And believe it or not, it's a myth that frozen veggies are not as nutritional as fresh veggies because technically they just take them out and freeze it right away. So all the nutritional value is there as well. Gotta preheat this oven. 420 blaze it. Scratch that. We aren't actually eating fries. I just realized that we have these veggie hash browns, low carb and plot twist. I realized that these only come with six. So I bought veggie tots just in case and I'm going to use some of this and I will be eating this all for myself because Emily cannot eat bacon. And remember guys, the calorie count that will be on the screen later when we start eating is only going to be for me. I'm not going to be accounting for Emily because she eats negative like 300 calories a day and that's why she's so skinny anyways. Um, you need to eat more, babe. She's going to have to do it when she sleeps at night. I pour chocolate milk down her throat. That's probably why she shed so bad because uh, she's lactose intolerant. Fuck you. <laughs> so when it comes to these turkey burgers, all I like to add on them are pink Himalayan sea salt and some black pepper. And for Emily, she doesn't like too much black pepper because she's white and you know, white people can't really handle spice. A little dab. Whenever I cook turkey, I like to season a lot with a lot of salt because turkey doesn't really have too much flavor. That. Make sure you season both sides. And also, if you guys are wondering, we are gonna be adding cheese. We are gonna add some sharp cheddar on mine, and for her, just provolone, I'm gonna probably do one of each. Don't worry, I am gonna account for everything. I'm gonna even also account for the oil and butter that we're gonna be using to cook with this as well, and the calorie count. We got the tots in the oven, broccoli and cauliflower in the microwave, about to cook up the turkey burgers, and about to smell like sex in here. If you guys have ever cooked with truffle oil, you guys will know how freaking good it tastes. So we're gonna throw a little bit of this on the pan. Like that. We're gonna throw those turkey burgers on. I wish you guys were here to smell the smells that I'm smelling. It smells like a smell, a smelly smell. A smell that smells smelly. A smelly smell that smells smelly. Pro tip, if you throw a chunk of butter and just slap it into the turkey burger, it's gonna taste way better. So on my burger, I am gonna add a egg on each burger and I'm gonna add some mashed avocados. If you guys don't know what this is, this is the way to go if you're too lazy to cut out and mash your own avocados. By the way, I use brioche buns because brioche buns, they taste bomb.com. All of that together just for the two burgers that I'm gonna make, I would say right around a thousand calories. Um, that's estimating in my head. I think it's gonna go over, but you will see the calorie count when I actually I'm eating it. And on top of that, I'm eating a whole packet of tater tots to myself. Maybe even some bit of veggie hash browns and some broccoli and cauliflower. And we still have more to eat after that. So I will catch up with you guys when the meal is cooked. Dinner is now ready. Let me show you guys what we got here. The blandest stuff, which is broccoli and cauliflower. I put some seasoned salt and also some Parmesan cheese on that. Then we got her bunless burgers right here. Put some avocado on that. And then we have the veggie hash browns right here with some Parmesan cheese. And dude, look at this sex. Egg, cheese, avocado, turkey burger. Also some veggie tater tots. And I haven't calculated this all, but don't worry, it will pop up on the screen right now for this meal. And I will already have calculated how much I ate if Emily doesn't finish anything, if I had to eat that as well. Anyways, I'm gonna plop the camera over here. We're gonna be watching TV shows and I'll probably speed through it or something like that. All right, first bite right here. Let them know how it is. I'm gonna give you guys my first bite. Look at how good it looks. Oh, it's so good. If you guys never had an egg on your burger, you are missing out. Yeah, I can eat pretty fast, bro. You should know this by now. <clears throat> we'll be dating for a year down the road. And she's still gonna be fascinated at the fact that I ate a burger in like a minute. I actually kinda wanna time myself on that next burger. For fun, I'm gonna set a timer to see how fast I eat this next burger. What's your bet? I'm gonna stick with a minute. I don't know if you guys can see that. The table's a little messy. There we go. Just to remind you guys, a piece of turkey burger, provolone cheese, egg, and avocado, and a brioche bun. Ready, set, go. It's so hot. All right, done. 45 seconds. Oh, 46. Jesus. Are you impressed with your boyfriend? I'm a little scared, actually. Not gonna lie. All right, I'm gonna go wash my hands. <laughs> You know what they say about guys who can eat pretty fast? They poop a lot. All right, we're gonna test out these veggie tots, see how good they are. These are my first time having them. How are those? These are good. Oh, you good? I'm my mom. I'll get you more. Oh, these are pretty good too. 
Whoa, these are really good. I wish you could have tried these. I have to find one without bacon. They literally taste nine out of 10 and 10 being a normal tater time. That's how close it is. How much you guys want to bet that I have to help her with her food? I bet a lot on that. Mm -hmm. Yo, those turkey burgers were amazing. Pro tip, if you're a girl out there, get a boyfriend that can cook. Double pro tip, if you're a boy out there, get a boyfriend that can cook. If you're a girl out there, get a girlfriend that can cook. Even better. Nah, we all know girls can't cook. Yeah. Guys need to stay in the kitchen. Fair enough. This honestly tastes better than a regular tater tot. I take that earlier claim back. Eating so many of these, they're so good. Look at this concoction she's made. She put two hash browns covering the turkey burger. If they watch me, they can learn to eat low carbs. Thumbs up the video if you guys want to see a full day in the life of Emily. All right, just like that, fucking done, bro. My done, I mean done with my plate. I gotta help her with hers. Here, I'm proud. Ooh. I'm cool, but I want to keep eating too much. Turkey burger, hash brown, baby. Oh, they are good. They're different than what mine is. Green Giant, I commend you guys. You guys make good food. Ugh, I'm getting full myself. Psych! Cauliflower overload. Yo, our poop is about to be crazy. We ate so much cauliflower today. I might just poop out a whole cauliflower stock. Imagine how crazy that'd be. It's like giving birth. All right, just like that, we finished with the first meal. Calorie count is right here. Anyways, I will catch up with you guys. Wait, can I point to it? Can you do it again? The calorie count is right here. You're such a weirdo. <laughs> Um, we'll catch up with you guys when we get like dessert and other things and by we I mean me because she only eats like the chocolate My girl Carrie, she loves this shit. Watch this <laughs> Fuck <laughs> Sure you guys the line up for tonight's snacking it's gonna be and again i don't know the exact amount of calories of all this that i'm gonna eat but i will put it while i'm eating it we have some roasted and shelled because i'm too lazy to actually shell it myself pistachios okio greek yogurt and this i do know is a uh, hundred calories i believe yep hundred calories we'll definitely eat all that we need a quest bar halo top four trader joe's versions of reese's cups but i know i'm only gonna eat three because emily's gonna end up eating one so some chinese oranges haha <laughs> get it yeah and some ch maybe some cheese groups. I'm not sure about that. <laughs> She's so cute. All right, we're gonna watch the show and you guys will watch me fast forward and eat my food. And I will have a calorie counter as we go. Emily doesn't want to be in this because she's weird. No, I'm joking. She looks amazing, but she doesn't think she does. Anyways, um, yeah, let's watch the show. Reese's Cups. These Trader Joe's ones are so good. Okay, ready? I guess. Okay. Dude, this Greek over is so fire. Pistachios. To eat three mandarin oranges. So, you best believe I want to finish this Halo shop, probably the rest of this Cheez Its and this Quest Bar. Um, I'm hanging out with Emily right now and I want to be annoying, so I'm gonna wrap up the video here. I will put the total calorie count and I'm gonna be honest too, because after I finish whatever I finish, I'll put it in here. I'll pop it right there. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. I know it's kind of a quick full day of eating and it's a little bit of kind of relaxed. Not not the usual structured OMAD eating, timed eating that I always do, but every now and then I like to uh, change it up. So I hope you guys enjoyed that. I Don't worry, there is a lot more content to come. Definitely planning on letting Emily take the camera for a whole day or something like that at some point. Yeah, stay tuned guys. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, hit that notification bell, and I'll catch you guys next time. Peace. Pacing for the profits, ain't no way we break the code. Keep your pockets like the tropics, don't let rocks disrupt your flow. We was outside with no options, all we knew was get and go.